like off of it, the solar panel off of it. Yeah, might be a slight odor yeah, from this, but oh well, not bad. We're going for a big one or a little one? Oh, I'm going to do a bigger one first. You're going to do one of Ben's? Seems the one, seems the one yeah, one of Benny's here, I'm sure right there. <laughs> there we go. You could light the light up a little bit, just turn yeah. that knob a little bit, it might be... Can you, Lucas, please? Thank you so much. There you oh, yeah. Go. Oh, there no, it, it might be hot. It'll be a little... That's all right. <laughs> there we go. Oh, and they're I, pretty fat, eh? Yeah, I just cut it down to, yeah, they are. I just cut it down to about there, so I still Oops. give me strength on this side to be able to have some push. Got some push again? Yeah. yeah. So halfway there. And you can feel the rib cages with the knife as you push on it there. Yeah. And then there. And just kind of get that far, then I kind of... Take this a little bit farther, maybe, and then. Oh, right to there. And then flip it over again, maybe, and just get this right out of the way off. There we go. To there. And then just do that. Oops. And a little too far there. There we go. With a with a fit, one filly off like that, see? Isn't that amazing? Yeah. Right. How quick they are to do. I'll just put that in there. Put that down, go down to the skin, and just let the knife, let the blade just do its thing. Pull on the skin, pull on the under part. Yeah. And then there's another one, right? There's your whole fish back right together. <laughs> you know, yeah. That's all you cut off of it? Pretty well. I, what I do is with the bass, I usually try to get a little bit of a cheap, uh, a little bit of a cheap uh, piece of meat in here that I kind of think is kind of nice. It's like a little nugget. Yeah. <laughs> Look at this. You can just peel it right off the skin. Look at that. Now see a little. Oh yeah. A little nugget there. That's a that's a prime rib. A prime rib. <laughs> <laughs> what would you call it? I guess that's a, it's like a... A tenderloin, right? Yeah, a tenderloin. That's it. And then kind of crease that in there like that. There we go. And then there's another one. Just like that. Oop. It's kind of a little deep on that one, but... There we go. There's a couple little, and usually I, usually I, let me see, I can just usually just, um, just throw them in. Well, this is the end of that. That goes in there. And we might as well just go with another one. Pull another one, this one. <laughs> another one of Ben's specials here. You're the big boy. <laughs> just go in behind that pin and just cut her down like that and then cut her back the other way. Turn it and don't go through the don't go through the rib cage. Eh? It's the right along parallel with the rib. The, yeah. The thing, yeah. Huh. And then you flip that over. And you never go back to a straight knife again after you do these. Yeah. Okay. You know. No. Just like that. Flip this one over and take this through. If you if you cut the whole side through quick, then you haven't it kind of floats around on you. They won't, they won't ah. stay together when you're wanting to do the second side. So I find that I just, just leave a little, a little bit. Just leave a little bit left, and then you can kind of get the whole side that way. Huh? Flip that over there. Just a little messy there. What I get with some of that. Get some of that blood off of there. <laughs> there, it looks a little better when you get it cleaned up a little bit. There we are. See there, you've got, there's nothing, there's no waste really there. It's right down to the... Yeah, it's right down to, right the, down to the rib cage. Huh. And their guts are all contained in one area, yeah. and then it's like mostly meat yeah. for the swimming power, the muscle. That's it, that's it. And then now we get to the other side. Designed by God to be perfect to eat. Is it? <laughs> that's, that's the thrill. It makes sense. Doesn't it? 
Look at that. Just slip that off like that. There's another one. That's that. Done. And if you don't, I'm, I'm a little, I'm sort of like to get this extra little step. Yeah. But if you're just doing the fillets, you want them done quick like that, you're done. Just with the flash. Right? Yeah, those two little guys, yeah. you probably, probably aren't going to get those pieces off of. <laughs> The two little guys probably not going to be able to oh, salvage those. Yeah, I, I usually still try still to try. Them, yeah, <laughs> there they have enough to just the little nuggets. We had some of those nuggets last night somewhere. Oh, and man. so, do you think those nuggets are the best part? Or? Oh yeah, I think so. Yeah. I don't know. I think they are They're kind of nice little. little still saving, saving every bit you can, right? Uh, it's a long blade. It's my smaller one. Is wore out. You know, I, I go through it, and you go through the knives pretty good. Like you, uh, I, I uh, had a, a sperm knife for quite a while. I loved, and it I wore it out and just burned it out of it. But if you use knives like um, the regular uh, kitchen knife, mm -hmm. you know, electric knife, they just can't take the, uh, the pressure nice. of going through the. No, they can't. It seems like that they burn out quick. Hmm. Yeah. So there we go. There's a couple. Do you lift that lid? Yeah, I'll get the lid. Okay. Which one are we get next? Oh, well, oh this, this right here. Getting be good. that one was mine. All right. All right, my little here guy. Here comes. Here it comes. A little junior fish. On the on the counter it goes. <laughs> this is a big blade for, for a little fish bit, small size. fish, but it still works. It still works fine. Well, I'll take this one right through. It's just a little smaller. It shouldn't be as it's tough slippery. to keep together. Yeah, there we go. You know what you're doing. There we are. How's that? There we are. Look at these guts. <laughs> Look at them there. Just, just ribs, eh? Yeah. Uh, you clean it right off the skin. You know, waste, right? It's amazing. Yeah. People say, well, electric knife, you probably lose a lot. You no, know, you, you really gain more, I think. You've gone through times where you've done it without just a straight knife yep, with no electric. Yeah, I did, yeah, for years. And then I thought, there's got to be a better way. We love it so much, and I met fishing so much. Yeah. You know, so I just kind of went at it myself and decided I was going to make this work. <laughs> or, you know, we'd get nice. it to work. I think. I mean, there's probably other people that use them, but I have a lot of friends that... Never heard fish, of them before? Well, they, and they don't do it. They say, oh, I clean them, but with a straight knife, huh? Yeah. yeah. Like, I mean a non-electric. So a non this is a specialty yeah. knife that's this, this, designed this is, for this? Yeah, this is a, 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 a real a Berkeley... Uh, oh, okay. Uh, and that shape of that is sort of like for your... For, for your, your fillet, yeah. yeah. So they are, really. They are built for this. And I have a number of them that... I have another one on the table there that's sort of a backup. We'll sell, the, we'll sell this so, video to Berkeley. All right, that's right. <laughs> uh, just, uh, just, uh, I have a, I think there's two different blades, and I think I haven't put the other blade back in. So this is a little large for this this type of fish, but it works still. Yeah. It still works. Look at those little cheeks, see that? <laughs> <laughs> And now we got Krista's little guy left to go. Krista's next. There we go. Yeah, the last little fish. Yeah. Oh, for a second, I thought you were just throwing uh, it. No, up. no, I'm just getting rid of a little bit of... Uh, fish poop. <laughs> there we go. Oh, yeah, hers was still... I wish I could have gotten hers on video. Just oh. it flung off her rod and oh, then knocked itself it? out in the boat. <laughs> she almost knocked herself out? No, the she fish. was pulling the fish up, and she forgot to set the hook, and it was right by the boat, and she yanked. And it went flying through the air, almost hit Al, landed in the boat, knocking itself out. <laughs> that one? <laughs> this fish here? This little guy that here. Guy here was she didn't even have it. Like, it could have gotten away, but as it made the, 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 the move to escape her hook, she had whipped it up into the air, and it went flying into the boat. <laughs> no, there is. And it landed so hard, it knocked itself out. <laughs> it was in shock. Yeah. Usually, I uh, can you tell what has been eating in that. These are these are this. this just to kind of oh, see. Oh, yeah, little, yeah, little, yeah. Quite often, you you, you get cut through it. And look at that, just a little minnow. See that? Oh, <laughs> that is hand, cool. Here's what it had in its 
It was yeah. eating minnows. And, and it's, it's uh, well, let me see what. And usually they're head first. They take them in. Oh, they take so, them in head first? I think so, yeah. I think they usually. Sit. Oh, I well, That one was tail sitting first. tail first, though, well, so know. it caught this one from behind. Well, I don't know. It's hard to say. Uh, it's hard to say, they, yeah, because they could. Because I think they take them head first when. Uh, when we're ice fishing, they grab them and usually they turn them around and take them in head first. I think. Oh really? Yeah, they grab them. So they, they must they must hit them to yeah. kill them and so then cool. flip them around, eh? Yeah, I c could be. That must be what they do. Yeah. Anyway. Yeah. And I just kind of uh, just need to be. Uh, well, I don't bother cleaning them up much until I get down to the. Alright. Get the little see if there's a little cheek here. Did you have? Look at this thing, you just throw that there. I usually throw them in the water, but I'm just kind of leaving them there so you can kind of see them. a little picture of them, yeah. That. You're done. Oh, there it is there. There's a little, little cheek. cheek. Nice. <laughs> Boom, done. it goes. Done, like that. And then you usually just throw all I, these in the water here? No, now I, now I do the rest. Now oh. I, do, I, do the, I do the little... The, 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 the fine stuff. The finishing touches. The yeah. fine finishing. Yeah, yeah. I'll get rid of this little gucky stuff here a bit. Not the, not the, not the fish. <laughs> I do all this messy stuff over here. This here. So would you? Is this what you would do out in the boat, and then you would bring this back for? Your... I I bring I work some, no I do all of this would be done out there. All I of have it. a board, yeah. Oh, okay. And I, and I just bring them back in little baggies. Oh, okay, and I see. Little freezer bags, or keep them in water. Yeah. And usually have them in the cooler or yeah. in something that keeps them chilled. Today I meant to take. See that there's a little the rib cage kind of goes. There's a little bit of another little bit of a bone yeah, that comes yeah, up, a little bit it. of a, right, up, right here on the back side. Yeah. So I just go down to the middle and then just kind of cut back like that. Okay. And then right around the rib cage this way. And you can then, you can then just have, uh, this is meat too on the, on the, onto the stomach. You notice a little bit here? Mm. And then you just kind of shave it off like that. And there you are, that's boneless. And I'll put these all, i put them in there and get them a little wet and moisture, better to have them than water and chill. Yeah. And then that's a little the rib cage, see? Okay. And there's a little bit of bone that comes up the back, that comes up straight. Yeah. So it's in that kind of, you know? Yeah. yeah. So that's the end of that. And there's your, there's your fillet like that, see? Isn't that neat? Isn't that something? Yeah. Nice. And I just try to kind of get some of the scales and stuff off and then, and it's not as messy in the water and stuff, but... So that's that's just uh, meat, and right? Yeah. Nice. Marabu. Just like that.